Seattle stand out. Sportscast, and today we're doing our full show. So let's kick things off with our winners of the week. Yes. And for me personally, I have the Arizona Cardinals as my winner. Beating the Seahawks, I mean, that's a big win, so they're definitely my winner. Callum Murray outplayed Wilson, so they're my winner of the week. How about you, Levi? Well, for my winner, I'm going to go with the Indiana College. Um, as you can see, our reaction, football Indiana football team. Um, Indiana Hoosiers. You can see our, our reaction to that game, a game ending play, beat Man, Penn State, crazy. huge comeback. What a game. I mean, yeah, there's no way I couldn't put the Indiana Hoosiers. Was that a touchdown? Was that a touchdown? That reach? Yeah. You think it was? It was definitely a I touchdown. I was a debatable touchdown. But, yeah, I mean, they're going to stick with the call on the field, so I can see that. And they they uh, beat a number eight ranked team in the country, which is huge. First time they beat a top ten opponent um, since, like, 1980-something. It was a long time. All right. Um, my winner is uh, one of the Rays players. Um, a nobody that you've never heard of named uh, Brett Phillips that you might have heard of now. Uh, he got his first hit in a couple months. He just got brought up just for defense, and, uh, you know, he, he got up to the plate and hit a game winner. Down, game walk off. They got tonight, though. So. Uh, they got to win tonight if they're still alive, but without him, and the series would be over already. Cool. So, uh, yeah, good for Brett Phillips. Uh, you know, a moment he'll never forget, I'm sure. And he probably won't get another opportunity like that in his life. Let's be real here. He's Brett Phillips. Yeah. So good he took advantage of it. Yeah, and my loser for the week is probably going to be the Chicago Bears, or is the Chicago Bears. Everyone was starting to finally know, like, the Bears are a good team. Yeah. And then they have a terrible offensive showing. Full stars, three picks. The only touch in the defensive touchdown. And they lose to the Rams 24-10. Bears are not who we thought they were. I mean, maybe who he thought they were, yeah, but exactly not who we I thought they were. The rest of America. So, yeah, that bears my loser for sure. My loser is the Dallas Cowboys. I don't think yeah. I have to say anything else. Yeah. Moving on. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, my loser is probably going to be the Seattle Seahawks. Just because we were up by two scores with two minutes and 30 seconds left. And no, we're, with six minutes. No, we weren't. And, two, yeah. and uh, Oh, yeah, right, yeah. Right, oh, yeah. Right. And, um... We're usually the team coming back in that scenario, and it doesn't usually happen to us, but it happened to us tonight, and I know how all the other teams feel when we do it to them. It does not feel good because it seems like you have the game and then it goes out of your grasp. Uh, Russ did not play good down the stretch, but neither did our defense. Pretty much no one played good down the stretch. So, I mean, we deserve to lose. The only reason it even went – the only re- the only reason it went into later overtime is because they missed a field goal. So, I don't know. I'm going to give us a loss because we should have won. That's why. Alright, so if we should have won a game, then you make us a loser. <laughs> no, no, I said we should have closed out the game, and we didn't, uh-huh. which makes us a loser, in my opinion. 